Hi, I'm Justin. I'm an engineer at Transfer. I'd like to talk to you today about a project that I've been working on with some contractors. They're looking at updating and renovating some uh, production lines at a manufacturer site. And what we've got here are uh, two units serving two parallel production lines. Uh, we've got them stacked up for uh, space constraints. Um, and so what we've done is we've mounted them on the same skid as the um, pumps that are serving the process. Um, what that'll do is that'll just make it uh, nice and easy for our contractors to lift the whole skid at once uh, and drop it into place on site. So serving the, uh, each of the processes, we have a run and standby uh, pump set and an expansion vessel. So each um, circuit will have uh, one expansion vessel and uh, one set of pumps. Uh, so you can see here, you have um, this pair piped up to the top cooler and uh, the back pair is piped up to the bottom one. So on this side of the unit, we have uh, the control panels. There's uh, one control panel per cooler, uh, which will allow you to obviously control um, the unit, but it will also allow you to integrate the controls into the existing BMS. Because we are supplying the uh, cooler, pump set, and all the intermittent pipe work, we can make sure that the whole skid is tested and pre-commissioned before it goes out. Uh, what this will mean is that it will be in a, a plug and play configuration, which means that uh, once the contractors come, pick it up and drop it into place on site, um, all they've got to do is uh, plumb up the blank connections here, um, and then they're safe in knowledge that all they've got to do is supply power and the process water, and it's pretty much ready to go. Uh, Alright, so thank you for uh, listening to me talk about um, the projects that I've been working on. Uh, I'm Justin Transfer and I hope that I'll be able to um, present another one to you in the future.